uh, this particular white tree frog, she's probably about 10 or 12 years old. Um, she's been separated from the group. She has some health issues, and I'm kind of just keeping her on the desk, taking care of her, and hand feeding her. The exhibit that she used to be in was a decent size, or a good size vertical and horizontal space that she could use, and really not using it that much. And she's just not as active as she used to be. But the white tree frogs like to do a lot of perching. Sometimes they like to perch on the sides of things, up underside leaves. She's really just not doing that as much. She has trouble going to the bathroom when she goes. She passes blood. Um, she doesn't climb around and eat crickets or anything, so I just give her like small uh, rodents for a meal once a week. And um, she has a tumor on her back. The keepers are always going to be my best source of information on whether or not an animal that's in a slow decline has reached the point at which it is time to have a discussion about euthanasia. It gives me comfort to know that I'm able to make her comfortable, you know, before she passes. So, I, I, and that's what I like about geriatric animals. I like to give them that care, that special care. Um, she, you know, might have a few weeks, or it could be a month. Mm -hmm. Well, you don't think any longer. No, definitely no longer than that.